Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be showing you all how me and my best friend attempted and accomplished taking my bed down in my van about five and a half to six inches. So where you see the pink line on the leg of, one of the legs of the bed is where I um, marked where I wanted to take my bed down to. And I mainly marked it here because this is where my suitcase stood up just in case I didn't have enough room to lay my suitcase flat. This is the marker that I used. So for starters, I took everything off of my bed, the bedding and everything. Then I went in and took out some of the screws from out of the plywood. After that, I took a little break to take everything from, well, mostly everything from under my bed, which is called the garage area and van life. I'm starting all over. So after getting everything removed from the garage area, we went back in and started removing more screws from the legs and the base of the bed. This process, this should have only taken maybe 45 minutes. Um, we was BSing around a lot. We even took a lunch break, made some sandwiches, ate some chips. But this process was not hard at all. Like It shouldn't have took us no more than an hour for the entire process but of course it took us about two two and a half So when we finally got all of the screws out, I went to the backyard and started using the power saw, I believe it's called. And I started drilling down the legs of the bed, taking off about five and a half to six inches. So after getting all the legs up and screwing them into the base of the bed, we got the plywood back on top of the legs, screwing that on as well. After making sure everything was leveled, everything was secured and tight and the bed wasn't wobbly, we started um, making the bed up, putting everything back under the garage area and we got the job done. Now this process was not difficult at all. It even can be done, in my opinion, by one person, but you know, two set of hands is always better than one. So as you can see here, this is the before picture where my bed was coming um, next to or above my little dresser area. And here in the after shot, you can see my bed is actually sitting now below my little dresser area. And you can actually see where my pink suitcase is now laying flat. Here's the better picture from the front. Um, I love the outcome. Shout out to my best friend. You know, we always get the job done. Thank you all for watching this video. If you like what you saw, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. If you haven't already subscribed, and when you go to hit that subscribe button, if it's asking you to sign in, just go ahead and make a quick account for me. Hit that subscribe button. And if you want to see my content as soon as I post, make sure you hit that post notification bell as well.